in addition to, you know, Biden already has six trillion dollars in his three plans that he's just introduced. There's day after day new things. I just read an article today about eight billion going for the uh, post office being able to turn all of their vehicles into electric vehicles. Mm-hmm. We're spending eight billion on that. This is not inside the 2.2 trillion infrastructure. This is outside of that. Spending has really, really gotten out of control underneath Biden. It's been growing just in the last couple years, even before he took office. But now we're looking at the internet. So this is very interesting to me because when you talk about it, it is called the emergency broadband benefit. This was part of a bill that was passed last December that was nine billion dollars, $900 billion. Mm-hmm. Uh, it was already passed, but it went into effect yesterday. So that's the important element on how it is in the times. Now, what I think is interesting about it is the people that are eligible for it is not exactly who you would expect to be eligible. Some of them, yes. Uh, The people that, you know, are on the poverty level, that as well. But the interesting thing is, if you lost your job uh, since February 2020, and you have since had a job now since then, but if you lost your job any point between then and you made up to $99,000 in 2020, you can get this $50 off your internet bill each month. Wow. You are qualified. So that is for a single filer. If you're a joint filer, it's making $198,000. Yeah, not exactly poverty level. That's not poverty level. (laughs) These are not uh, people who need government handouts. No. So that's the most important thing, I think, about this. This is in addition to all the spending that we already had. The FEC already had another program where you'd be getting off $9 a month Mm. instead of the $50. Also on top of this uh, emergency broadband benefit is that you can get $100 off any computer or tablet or desktop computer than you want. So for me, before I came to this job, Uh, I was out of work for a small amount of time. I qualify for this. I can go and get $100 off any laptop that I want from the government now because I don't believe that that's how I I should be spending my money. I'm likely not going to do that. But it's crazy to me that I qualify for this. I feel like I am well off. I'm okay. I'm not a person who needs my internet paid. So I think that's really interesting. In addition to, you know, Biden already has six trillion dollars in his three plans that he's just introduced. There's day after day new things. I just read an article today about eight billion going for the uh, post office being able to turn all their vehicles into electric vehicles. Mm -hmm. We're spending eight billion on that. This is not inside the 2.2 2.2 trillion infrastructure. This is outside of that. We also, another bill was uh, set yesterday for gyms. $30 billion is going just for gyms alone. And, you know, it's great that we're, you know, helping out communities and different things, but gyms, shouldn't have they already been covered by all the other COVID packages that we've already been putting forth. Yeah, if they hadn't all been shut down by the government in the first place, it wouldn't be, we wouldn't even be having this conversation. (laughs) 